If you give a moose a muffin by Laura Umra, illustrated by Felicia Bond. If you give a moose a muffin, who wants some jam to go with it? So you'll bring out some of your mother's homemade blackberry jam. When he has finished eating the muffin, he will want another and another. And another. And when they're all gone, he'll ask you to make more. You'll have to go to the store to get some muffin mix. He'll want to go with you. When he opens the door, he feels how chilly it is, and he asks to borrow a sweater. When he puts the sweater on, he'll notice one of the buttons is loose. He'll ask for a needle and thread. He'll start sewing. The button will remind him of the puppets his grandmother used to make. So he'll ask for some old socks. He'll make sock puppets. When they are all done, he'll want to put on a I want to put on a puppet show. He'll need some cardboard and paints. Then he'll ask you to help make the scenery. When the scenery is finished, he'll get behind the couch and put his and his but his antlers will stick out. So he'll ask for something to cover them up. You'll bring him some sheets from your bed. When he sees the sheet, he'll remember he wants to be a ghost for Halloween. He'll try it on and shout. Boo! It'll scare him so much that he'll knock over his paints. So he'll use the sheet to clean up the mess. Then yell, ask for him some soap to wash it out. He'll probably want to hang the sheet up to dry. He'll go outside to put it on the clothesline. When he's out in the yard, he'll see your mother's blackberry bushes. Seeing the blackberries will remind him of her jam. Probably ask you for some. Chances are. If you give him the jam, he'll want a muffin to go with it. Thanks for listening.